in the UK there is one book that is so special it must be protected at all costs. I'm talking of course about the Quran. As we all know, to even begin touching its holy pages, one must first bathe their hands in holy isopropyl alcohol. Only then may the ritual ceremony of the wearing of the gloves make amends. For damaging its sacred pages will bring down a justifiable jihad upon any who have struck such a blow to the religion of peace. This brings me to the topic of today's video. Four children have been suspended from a secondary school in West Yorkshire for damaging a copy of the Quran. The book had been brought in for a day and had been treated less than kindly by the kids. However, the headmaster himself said there was no malicious intent behind it. In my own childhood, I was raised to treat all books, even those with content I disagree with, with respect, in the sense that it is a person's right to say what they believe, and if they put their beliefs in a book, it means they can be picked apart and combated by the outlandish idea of debate. For after all, this is a free country still, isn't it? In any fully functioning, democratic society, the pupils would simply be punished under the remit of the school system, and everyone would move on. But no, this concerns the religion of peace. The police must become involved. I'm sure if a Bible was scratched and a bit battered, they would come skulking around as well, wouldn't they? What's that? No? You don't think so? Ah, that's right. Only one religion matters in the UK now. The last time I checked, we were not living under Sharia law. And I'm relatively certain we don't have blasphemy laws anymore. To any non-religious person, a religion's holy book is simply just a book. Trying to strong-arm people into treating it as you would if you were a member of that religion isn't going to help your cause. It's only going to hinder it. At the end of the day, your feelings on any specific book do not matter. If your religion cannot stand up against mockery or criticism, it just goes to show how pathetic it really is.